Hello guys, what's up? So today in this video, we will be talking about some of the issues and fixes which the game Need for Speed Heat is facing. Now, as you guys know, Need for Speed Heat has been uh, released by the P2P as well as Dodi, but still gamers are facing a lot of issues. So in this video, we'll be talking about some of the issues and fixes which the game is having, that the game is having, and so probably you can fix those issues. So today in this video, we are going to talk about the issues like origin not install issue fix, black screen fix loading issue fix and also an update on a better version of nfs heat whether any scene group will is interested or have they started work on it codex or cpy update on that so let's get started with the first issue fix and the first issue fix is regarding origin not install like i see a lot of many comments uh, people have commented that uh, they are getting origin not install issue while launching the game so the prerequisite for this is that make sure you have never installed origin in your system if if ever you have installed origin in your system, make sure you uninstall it and also go to the directory where you have installed it and completely remove the folder which is very much required because after uninstallation also there are folders and files there in the C drive if you have installed C drive which may hamper the game performance and also this error could be because of that. Now after you have done that, restart your system. And then again, if you're facing this issue, then this issue could be because of your DirectX issue because that is not allowing your game to launch and instead the game is going into that origin not install block or error. So for that, you have to do is that open and media control panel, go to manage 3D setting, program setting, select the game from the list and set vertical sync to adaptive half refresh rate that will help your game to quickly run before going into that origin not install. So you may get the origin not installed, but the game would run and you will be able to play that. So hopefully this fix could help you gamers. So moving on to the next, that is the black screen fix. Now many of the gamers, like a lot many gamers are having this black screen fix. They are, they are launching the game and they are getting a simple black screen on the screen. So for them, what they have to do is go to the NVIDIA control panel, go to manage 3D setting, program setting and set vertical sync to fast. So in both the case, vertical sync is the issue which is creating the problem. For black screen, especially for black screen, you have to set it to fast. And like, don't worry for AMD uh, graphics card user also, they would be having a control panel and they would be having the same vertical sync option and which they can manipulate and try running this game. Now let's move on to the next, which is the loading issue fix. Now this issue must have happened because you have overclocked your GPU and the GPU is factory overclocked revert the clock speed back to the default value and the issue should be resolved. Now the loading issue is, is different from black screen because in loading issue the game would not run. It would run when you open task manager you will see that the game is running but you cannot see the screen. That is a loading issue error and for that you have to do this fix to like completely settle this issue. Now also one more important fact that uh, those who have installed the P2P, P2P, rather P2P version, they can really check the Dodi repack which I have just uploaded on my channel and that is uh, the gamers are facing less issue in that. That is also not 100% and uh, let me tell you that is not also 100% because uh, that game can also encounter some issue but that is having less issue. Now let's move on to the major debate point whether any C group would be working on it and whether uh, they would be bringing a uh, better version of NFS Heat so that it will work on all the system. So the answer is definitely yes. After the files have been out by P2P now, this trend of a P2P individual uh, releasing the game has given a lot of pressure on the scene group because the group as you know is like far more superior than the P2P individual. So they have something on their plate to show the P2P that they are still the master of this game. So definitely yes, NFS heat would be worked upon by a C group. Uh, till now it is not yet clear Codex or CPY. Most probably it would be CPY. But let's see who works upon it. But the answer which I am getting on like a lot of forums and reports that yes, they would be working on it and it could be soon because the P2B like what you call uh, the blueprint is out and it won't be taking that much time for a better version. So for those, so for those gamers who are thinking whether to download the Dodi repack or the P2P or they are thinking or to deciding to wait for a better version yes you can wait for a better version because that could be also soon so hopefully like this video and this video was really informative and if i am not able to fix your issue do comment below i will be try to look upon some of the issues which you are getting and our next target is 5000 subscribers so 
bless this channel, support this channel, and let's hope that we achieve 5,000 subscribers as soon as possible. So see you in another video. Bye bye. Take care. Don't forget to hit that like, share button, and subscribe button. Bye bye. Take care. Keep gaming.